After 33 years as a firefighter, Chuck Stinger retired, but not the way he wanted to. I had to give almost everything up. The fire department transferred me into uh, prevention and investigations for the last five years of my career because of this. His knee hurt off and on for years, but before he retired, out on a call, the pain brought him down. It felt like a knife was being shoved right into my knee. Stinger was diagnosed with osteoarthritis, but worried about recovery time and the toll a total knee replacement would take. When I found this study, <laughs> I said, I'm going to sign up for it. The multi-medical center clinical trial involved a device implanted into the patient's knee. We're looking at a, a shock absorber similar to what you would see in a car. Dr. David Flanagan at Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center says 90% of the patients who have gotten the device at his hospital have seen improved function and less pain. It's taking some of that shock or some of that force, that stress that the knee sees when you're weight bearing. And that can be over 30% of that, that shock or that stress where it's unloading that from that compartment. That includes Stinger, who's now had the device for three years. It has made my life whole again. I'm able to climb ladders. I'm back golfing again. Not good, but I'm still golfing. For Health Minute, I'm Mandy Gaither.